Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Ravenport 19. Folks, it is the same day as the last episode, but uh, as you can tell it's getting dark on me. I'm going to try to get this finished before it gets dark. Might have to do a little nighttime work. Maybe not that much. I don't like doing nighttime work. But uh, anyway, how are y'all doing today, folks? Y'all doing all right? I have the Kentucky Farmer Plow here. Um, it is private. In order to get it, you have to join his Discord, sub to his channel, and stuff like that, and, and all that good stuff. Uh, but anyway, it, it does run pretty good. And as you can see there, I got outline already. Uh, straight line from there to up there, then it curves around. And that straight line all the way down to the other end. Straight line all the way to the trees, and that curves back. We'll see that here in a minute. Um, I've been thinking really seriously about getting another tractor, folks. Uh, I just don't want to do it right now. I want to do it tomorrow uh no n not another episode but in this episode I'm trying to get tongue-tied here I'm trying to keep y'all happy y'all y'all probably get mad at me what you said it'd be this episode no uh, it will be i uh, just got to get this stuff done first uh, i'm trying to do wow back up Um, yeah, that was hard. I had to uh, straighten some of that out. So, uh, that took a little bit of money. But, I got figuring, do I want a wheel track tractor or a track tractor? Or wheel track. <laughs> Wheels on a tractor or track on a tractor. Uh, that's what I've been uh, spating, uh... Custom Modern's got a pretty good row crop tractor. Uh, but then again, uh, Stevie's got a good 8 uh, r track tractor out. And both of them looks pretty good. I uh, just don't know which one to choose, folks. I wish I had the money to buy both, but I don't. I actually probably thought about holding off, but if I hold off to the harvest, you know, I'm missing out on opportunities because I have a plow. I have a fertilized buggy. And I have a cedar. And a weeder. And a beater. Oh, wait, wait, what? Uh, no, nobody's getting beat. Nobody's getting beat here. I uh, wish this spot right there wasn't there. I could hire a worker. But uh, let's hire a worker for a second. And then, whoop, wrong button. Go in here. Um, Actually, I do need the other one. I know I need 400000 I wasn't going to get it right now. Because of the bank. I, I gotta be careful. Uh, oh, still worker. <laughs> uh, it's allowed to create fields. Oh, I gotta be careful because uh, worker does have. You can hire a worker to create a field as long as it's got part of another field. If that makes any sense. But uh, let's see. I think what I want to do is go ahead and hire a worker here. And then we're going to get over here in this tractor. And spray some lime. See so where I need to start. I think I need to go back this way. Now what he's going to do, he's going to turn around in the grass field there. Because he don't know no better. And uh, he'll finish that out. Which is far wouldn't be a bad thing. Uh, 
I really need to put the uh, seven more on this buggy. Have the new tractor plow. Have the new tractor plow. Have the seven more on this buggy. Have this tractor on the uh, cultivator. And I have no idea. Oh, it's getting dark too. See, that's one. I can't remember how far this spreads. I think I'm need to go over. Oh, don't jackknife. Yeah, I'll just do it this way. Give him a couple more minutes to get on over. And let's see, one, two, and turn right here should do it. And start liming. Oh, oh, oh. Get over. I forgot which one I had. Huh. Now, this is how you get a couple of things done at once, folks. Um. But anyway, uh, in case some of you are new, I forgot to do this in the beginning. Uh, my name is Tommy Miller, a.k.a. Mr. Blue. And of course, you see, I have a YouTube channel. I've got 700 and... Probably 760 videos, time this one is published, around about. So I'm almost uh, on that 1,000 video mark. I wish I was at a thousand subs, but uh, it'll come in due time. As long as I keep all my ones I got now happy. Uh, what I was going to do is just go down through here, folks, so y'all can see what I've done. It was just a straight line. I went ahead and left some of these hills in there for realistic value or whatever, how you want to say that. Well, I got to get a bigger tractor on this buggy. I'm going way slow on those hills. Okay, now we're picking up speed. As long as I don't overlap. Underlapping is bad, but overlapping is extremely bad because you're doubling up on what you just did. But uh, I couldn't touch that around the fence there at the uh, biogas eating plant or whatever it's called so I just had to do it the best way I could and I uh, hope it works park some of the tools and stuff there as you can see you got the mower and stuff there I see I'm gonna just shut that off right there swing around Let's go check on the other tractor, shall we? Yeah, yeah, there we go. I'm seeing encoder issues now. It's the first time I had that in a long time. Of course, folks, you gotta realize when y'all watching this, um, y'all probably see this sometime in February. But uh, I'm actually recording. I think this is the 23rd of January. So yeah, got a ways off there. But uh, you know, I was recording a stockpile of videos uh, as time y'all see this. I don't know if I got them all out or not, but um, yeah, so be sure and uh, check them out if y'all knew. If you ain't, y'all can go back and watch some new ones. Right, I'm a high worker again there. And let's... Uh, Start spraying again here. I hate overlapping like that, but just trying to get it where I 
All right, now I'm gonna hire a worker here. And this guy's okay. Here's the grass we got off that one field. Uh, that trailer sitting right there, I think I'm gonna sell it and just keep this flatbed truck. It seems like it's been going to work pretty good. Um, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. They're not going to do that on me. I know that's already been limed. But uh, I'm just going to redo everything again. Just so everything will be even. And I can't hire a worker through this right here. Because it's already been plowed. So that's where I come in. And I have uh, repaired this tractor. I sold uh, the wind roller and the uh, smaller plow in the last episode. So uh, y'all haven't seen that, go check that out. And I might be able to keep up with him. It's going to be hard to say. I don't know if I can get it planted by night time or not. Uh, I usually go to like 20, 2100 hours and uh, then fast forward time. But folks, I think our farm's coming along pretty good. What do y'all think? Uh, I really need to go ahead and just uh, fast forward time and uh, just come back in the morning. Uh, I'm just hoping that it don't rain, though. Know, that's what I'm concerned about because it's cloudy. Of course, I haven't seen rain in Ravenport <laughs> since I played. Uh, played a Michigan map and um, I think it was on the third day it was raining uh, he, no, he's, he's going to definitely catch me He's definitely going to catch me, folks. So I'm going to have to stop him. Uh, I should be able to get through uh, this section right here. Oh, look at the dust he's making. Well, he is covering some ground when you hire a worker. Wow. Now, speaking of covering some ground... Uh, go ahead and hire him out, and then we'll switch over. He's almost empty. I'd have to take him back up to the shop. For sure. The, the not the farm shop, the market shop, old folks. Uh, I'll tell you what. I am going to do a jump cut. Uh, Y'all see what's pretty much going on here. I'm going to finish plowing across, get all this plowed, and then get all this limed. And then we're going to switch out the tractors for, uh, oh, please, oh, 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 yeah, we're not going to worry about that little section. I'm going to uh, see what he does right here. Okay, he's going to stop right there, so that's okay. I'm going to go across this end. And then uh, we're just going to run our lime out on this side, I guess. But yeah, I'm going to do a jump cut. Now, I guess I will come back and uh, when I get these two fellas uh, done with this field, and we'll jump to our next field. So I'll be back in just a second, folks.
All right, folks, I'm back. We got the Submar down here, ripping up the ground. Oh, here, let's run over and check on the chickens. Yeah, they a little bit dirty. Uh, we got one box of eggs so far. Uh, first, uh, let's t before we talk about the animals, folks, I have field eight, fertilizing 28,000. I cannot pass that up. I don't accept that. And field five is sugar beet uh, to central, central grain elevator. Okay, central grain elevator is right here, folks. And uh, field five is right there. I can't pass that up. Field 12 is right there. And they go to central grain also. Uh, let's see. This one here. Uh, yeah, five and 12. Sugar beet, 12, central grain. But instead of borrow the items, I'm going to accept contract. And on field five, I'm going to accept. So that's three active right there. What's 13? Sugar beet to ranch. I'm going to be tired of sugar beets, folks. Uh, what was these? Wasn't they sugar beets? Yes. Sugar beets. So, field 13 is the only thing I have to worry about that's going to go to ranch instead. Uh, no biggie. We're going to accept. For like Mr. Blue, you don't have a uh, sugar beet harvester. Well, folks, I'm fixing our lease one. So there's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, yeah, four active apps. Um, they should hold do for a little bit. Uh, sheeps are doing good, folks, or chickens. Uh, got 102 eggs. Next animal in 10 and a half hours. Woohoo! So that should mean that we get one, that's 24 and a half. 24 and a half and nothing on those uh, we need to clean them when we clean them put that back in our food will be full so and our horses are at 27,000 folks 27,000 54 percent so they're getting on up there they are getting on up there but anyway we got some uh oh we got to borrow some money <laughs> uh we go on to We want to see how much we can borrow all together. There's our tractor right there. We're going to need another 25000 to uh, I don't think we need that much money. But, oh, that's all up. Uh, be 926000 all together. Now, I have already, um, I had to dump this, so I'm going to dump it right up here. Uh, why? That looks pretty good. Uh, these are grass bales, and we're just going to, hopefully, right there. And we'll put them in later. Um, Got to drop this trailer somewhere. Reason for we gotta go hook onto our hopper bottom. See so lower and there. That should do it. We gotta hook to our hopper bottom. Well, we're fixing to buy our, our tractor, folks, in here in just a second. I wanna make a road that goes down through here and put some gravel down or asphalt or something. But it's pretty much of a straight line. Now, since I only got one fertilized mission, um, we're going to, he, he won't be long on that. We're going to use him 
But uh, our truck here, our hopper bottom holds 100,000 liters. Um, the sugar beet machine and stuff we're going to rent and stuff has been modified. So I hope it works. It's been modified by me, folks. Um, let's go to this first. And beet technology. We're going to go all the way over to this in here. It does all of it. We got cotton potatoes, sugar beets, sugar cane, and whatever that is. I don't know. That sounds like wood chips, is it chaff or something. But anyway, I wish we could buy this thing, but I don't want to do all that money. So we're going to lease it for $25,000. So hopefully we get these fields done as fast as we can. All right, that's that. Uh, beat technology, and then again, all the way over to here. Um, at 16.7, 10 mile an hour. Uh, we're going to uh, lease this bad boy. And, uh, yeah. Oh, lordy. Yeah, I gotta hurry up and get uh, this up here cleaned up before John and them gets upset with me. Okay, see, that's what I like about this guy, the Semar. He does a pretty good job. Now, we got weeds coming in. So, we're going to have break our spur out. That's causing me fast forward in time overnight. So, um, we're going to go back into tractors. There's several things I want to get. One's going to be a tractor. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get the one by Custom Modding, which is right here. Uh, I checked this out and went down to engine setup, and it's only 420. Uh, the other few tractors I looked at was the same way. But this in here, if we go engine setup, we get 450 horsepower, so... We're going to put a big weight on the front. All right. Yeah, because it's not going to let us do a three-point hitch on this, and which that'd be all right. Uh, I'm going to go with the row crops, but I'm going to go this way, folks. Yeah. And that's how I want it. It's $388,750. I'm going to buy this bad boy. Uh, yeah, it's still 450 horsepower. Let's make sure. All right, I'm back up, and we are going to go to auger wagons. And for right now, um, actually, I'm gonna hold off on this. Uh, I was wanting this, and but it's only 33,000. Does it have a uh, the standard and wide tires on it. I was hoping it hold a little bit more than that, but this in here holds 38. And uh, we'll go with those tires. It makes it a little bit taller. And we're going to go with the uh, capacity with 38,000. What is this, 54,000? Yeah, we had enough to buy the sugar beet harvester. I tell you what, we're going to go ahead and get this. This is going to be for crops, lime, and some other stuff. Hopefully. When we're doing lime and stuff, we'll use this. Uh, so 38000 Yeah, We're going to go ahead and buy that for fifty-four. And uh, I think it's just about it. 
I was wanting to look at something else, but I can't remember what it was to save my life. I know we need a loader wagon, but that's going to wait a little while. Oh, I was going to get some more sheeps. Uh, also, I was going to... One other thing here, too. Let's see. I don't know what's the difference in this uh, besides cut, cut. We're going to go with fat. And we're going to leave it just like it is on the design color. I just don't know if our truck will pull it all. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I'm on. That's all I'm going to do right now. I was thinking about getting a uh, hopper bottom, folks, but. Let's see, let's hop out of here. And yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about right there. The ADAR, got the buddy seat, place for the laptop, some nice controls here, cup holders, got the radio to jam, I wish there was a way we can add the monitors and stuff, but be alright, it would be alright, um, let's see here, I really need to get oh that's compacted up here. Uh trying to think. Yeah, I need to get this guy. Need to finish him out a little bit. I got uh, down there on the end I gotta do. And uh I think we're gonna put this guy. Oh, whoa. Um, since we're quite a bit ahead, think about just running him. I got some, uh, fertilizer up by the shop in the tender wagon. And, uh, I'm going to put the, uh, one that's in the shed on and take it up to fill eight and get him started in that. Um... Probably gonna get the planter. I don't know how I'm gonna do the weeds. Uh, this is a little section there to spray. That's kind of kind of odd, you know. So I might wait a little bit before I plant because I I still gotta fertilize my ground. I totally forgot about that. So. I get this little section right here. It's where I was made a boo boo when I was leveling this out and stuff. Well, it shouldn't be a boo boo no more. If I can fix this. Okay, I should do close enough. All right, the sugar beets I'm gonna do off uh, off screen because that's gonna take a while. And you know what, folks? I need to go ahead and just. It didn't take very long to get that. I'm thinking about just go ahead and letting this guy do this over here. Uh, what he can of it, and I'm gonna. While he's doing that, I'm going to be getting the sugar beet harvester up to five and, uh, actually we got three fields, don't we? Five, twelve, and thirteen. Alrighty, um. What I might do is turn around this guy around and just go over and disc them down if that's all we get. And then plant. But we need a, a bigger... Uh... Okay, 
All right, I'm going to get this thing out of the way, folks. And uh, I guess I will see y'all on the next episode because uh, I'm probably getting a little bit out of time here. I've been trying to keep them around 30 minutes. It's kind of hard to do anything. Oh, man, it is. How's that? Oh, I got to go around. I think. Let me make double sure here. Yeah, because that's, yeah, okay, yeah, I got to go around. Um, I guess next thing we need to work on is actually getting a, yeah, another or a bigger harvester. Got to get some crops coming in first, so. Uh, or horses, when we sell them, that'll help out a lot. Uh, you gotta get some of this stuff organized folks and then uh, we'll go from there but like I said I know how uh, I should be out of time here the only thing about recording in uh, sections there you, you kind of lose track of how long you did record I think it was 15 minutes on the other little clip so 16 minutes on this and about 31 minutes so far I'll just show y'all how this thing folds up. Uh, put it on a header. Fold up. Wow! Yeah, I unfolded the machine. Get it folded back in. And try not to hit nothing. Well, folks, I appreciate each and every one of y'all for hanging in there with me and uh, support me and give me all that TLC it really means a lot to me no I don't know which field to start on I could start on 13 because it's right here those go to the ranch yeah I gotta go around this Hope ain't no train coming but anyway folks I might include some of this on the next episode I don't know uh so, uh, yeah, once again, thank you for uh, being loving, caring, and all that stuff. And I uh, appreciate all of it, folks. And y'all have a, a great day, a blessed day. I will see y'all in the next episode. Later. <laughs>